Champions of the Realm. I've been playing Dungeons and Dragons since Fiend Folio was a new release. So since the new, the early 80s, I've been at this for quite a while. Uh, it's a pure nerdery, and it is certainly a pool that I enjoy swimming in. It's hard to count when I started playing Dungeons and Dragons, but it actually was more recently than a lot of my peers. And I only played on stream, never rolled a physical die, always rolled digital dice for the first three or four years that I was playing. Um, now I have plenty of physical dice as the problem hits us all. But uh, yeah, so I guess I started playing probably about eight years ago. Um, it, it feels like it's such a part of my life that I can't believe it was that, that recently, if you will. I'm very glad that I took the tough feat because I think I'm going to need every single hit point I have. I'm going up against a paladin. I'm a sorcerer. It's, it's not going to go well. Usually when I'm getting ready for a game with Evelyn, it's mostly about what are some of the fun stories I can tell. You know, I can speak to animals, I can persuade people, I can do funny things, you know, to enter entertain an audience. So the PVP aspect is totally new and it's been really fun to take a look at Evelyn and say, okay, if she was really just trying to prepare to fight, what would I take? And I feel like it's helped me understand the character a lot better. I've never been much of a min-maxer, but I've always just kind of been confident in Evelyn's tanky ability to take whatever anything throws at her. So taking that and then on top of it, having put an element of strategy has been really fun. Paladins are very good at making saving throws and I'm a spellcaster, so her failing saving throws would really work well for my battle strategy. We'll see if the dice cooperate. When I first started thinking about playing versus a sorcerer, my thoughts were like, okay, how do I maybe incapacitate them, lock them down right away? What are some fancy things I can do to buff myself, to make myself harder to hit with spell damage? But the more and more I thought about it, if we have three to five rounds, I'm a paladin, I have lots of hit points, sorcerer probably doesn't have quite as many. My strategy became, how do I hit as hard as I can, as fast as I can, and then with Evelyn especially, most of her spells are bonus actions that have to do with if you hit someone, then this other thing happens. So most of my strategy revolves around just trying to hit as much as I can, and then if I do, add some other fun spell stuff on top. I'm playing for Make-A-Wish. I've actually done some work for Make-A-Wish in the past. Often people who've uh, been working with the Make-A-Wish Foundation come up to Bioware for a tour of the studio, and they often ask for me as a, a guide, uh, and I'm only too happy to go along. Most of the time when I play for charity, it's for large charities that are doing amazing big things, but since I got to choose any charity I wanted this time, I have a very small little dog rescue in Vernonia, Oregon, from which I got my Pomeranian Nizki. So I'm playing for a displaced pets rescue. <laughs>